it going guys? It is your boy, SatcomsH03, and today on Questionable Nerf, we ask the question, is the Zombie Strike Slingfire a good blaster? Now for those of you who do not know, the Slingfire was a Zombie Strike blaster that was released in this year and also cost this much. And it's a pretty cool blaster in my opinion. It's lever action, you can do it like that, or you can do it one-handed. That kind of coolness, or you can do the cool Terminator thing where you flip around like that. Now, originally it came with a six round magazine, uh, this one's just spray painted a little bit, but it slapped it on home. It came with this many zombie strike darts, you primed it, and then you fired it. Now, here are a few more interesting facts about the zombie strike sling fire. Now, as I said before, the Zombie Strike Slingfire came with a six round magazine and six Zombie Strike Green Elite style darts. And basically, once you load in the darts in the magazine and you put the magazine in the blaster, it is a not bad blaster altogether. You can, of course, fit uh, different size magazines in the blaster if you want by taking out six round and filling it in with any other one. But altogether, it's not bad blaster. Now, some of you may be wondering, Zet, why is this blaster questionable? It's a freaking awesome blaster. It's a lever action blaster that's magazine fed and it's got regular elite standards and performance why would this be questionable well see the thing is it may have elite standard performance but also sometimes it doesn't have elite standard performance for some reason it will shoot the regular range you shoot it at but sometimes it just won't perform at all it'll just get 35 40 foot shots which is kind of meh but also, like, lever action. It's not really that practical, some people may think. Because, oh, I mean, you're moving the whole blaster, and it's, it's not as practical as, say, pump action, or as fast as pump action. Or it's not as stealthy as, say, slide action, for example. Well, my friends, the thing is, lever action, for all those who are, you know, like, the big hammer shot fans, like I said before, lever action you can do one-handed. And it will still work phenomenally. You can even also do the cool tricks like that. But also, for example, if you're behind something, like if you're behind a wall, for pump action, you'd have to have your hand out here, making yourself visible. If you're behind a wall, you just go ahead and find the sucker. Like that. You don't have to have your hand out here. You can just one-handed around a corner, whatever. I really like this blaster. I have one modified, all that kind of good stuff. And I love using this thing in battle. And it's it, all together, it's a really cool blaster. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe on Instagram, all the goodness. And I'll see you guys in the next episode.